or the farmer is now in a mountain village called Istan and it's look at the all the greenness here and dandelion and, and sorrel and other stuff <laughs> and also funny music from this mountain village which is like a three four hundred meters from the sea level and we'll see what grows here if we can eat horta somewhere here unless we bring it ourselves to the restaurant There are so much horta that you have to have a trailer to pick it for the local horta farmer. Istan is in fact pretty touristic because many hikers come there and um, they can take their money and very nice views and hiking trails and on the way we saw these water reservoirs that were built in the 70s but they are pretty dry nowadays and, and there's a water shortage all the time so just very little there left but the village of Istan has uh, 1500 people living there so it has other life besides tourism and it has Moorish North African roots and you can still see them in the um, waterways built in those times like Levadas and they come, the water comes from Sierra de la Nieves and you can still drink the water in these places let's do it Let's take a look what sort of plants, edible wild plants, we have <coughs> on the sides of this walk and in the meadows. Rosemary. Mmm, I smell. Yes, dandelion and even nettle. Dandelion for the lentil soup of today. Okay, in the whole of Istan, we couldn't find any restaurant with horta or even lentil soup, so we had to settle for a very nice creamy tomato soup, which was excellent with the dandelion leaves. And the nettle we found, we just brought home. <laughs> 